So chances are, you're watching this video because you've made the same mistake that I did. And you've updated to Camtasia 2018 from Camtasia 9. And you're ready to export your finished video in crisp, smooth 60 frames per second. So you click share, you hit local file. Well, hold on a second. There. You hit share, you hit local file, you choose mp4 only because you don't need a smart player when you're uploading a video to YouTube, and you finish it, you export it, it renders, you upload it, and uh oh, it's in 30 frames per second. So I'll show you the reason this happens. If you click on custom production and you edit your presets, Here's the preset we used, MP4 only, and the frame rate, for some reason I can't fathom, is set on 30. Even though you've changed your video settings to use 60 frames per second in Camtasia. So rather than using this, we'll create our own new preset um, that will accomplish this for us. So you can just name it the same way, uh, like MP4 only, but custom. Fancy, right? Choose MP4. Um, smart player is the only option, but we'll disable that in the next tab. So just uncheck produce with controller, and that disables anything to do with smart player. Now you want to click the video settings tab and change this to 60 frames per second if it's not already. And change any of these other settings if you want. And hit next and hit finish and that's going to be your preset. So now uh, when you're ready to export hit share custom production and choose your custom preset and now this is going to use 60 frames per second instead of 30 and it'll look much smoother. Anyway I hope this was a helpful video for you and I hope you will check out some of the other videos on my channel, namely my lyric videos, and I thank you for watching.